Hi there everyone, how are you? Simon back here again for another episode of the healing. So whilst the bathroom floor is sort of drying and sort of waiting for the washing to dry, I thought I'd do a quick video for you folks for 20 sort of minutes for you. Um, hopefully it doesn't last longer than 20 minutes anyway. So like I said, hope you all keep it safe. So I think this is now part 33, I think. So I think it's 32, 33, might even be 34, I don't know. But anyway, so just very briefly before we get into it, in the last part we sort of eventually sort of, um, basically, we are sort of obviously now scot-free from these people who sort of accused us that we are Dr. Crow's sort of associate, I suppose. Also, um, do excuse me about that, it's just post. And obviously, probably the biggest thing I think after all of it, it turns out there is a spy in the group. There's an associate with Dr. Crow in the group, in the strangers group. Who is it? I do not know. It could be anyone. It could even be who we are, well, it could, it could be Anna, it could be Lucy, it could, I doubt it would be Lucy, what, why would she put herself through that, I do not know, but anyway, but I give my sort of top three sort of suspect, suspects, um, if I sort of remember rightly, if it's sort of Julius was one of them, I think Bernard could be one of them, and even Zoe could be one of them, we don't know, but anyway, let's not waste any more time getting into it for part 33 of The Healing, so here we go, chat to Shadow first. So he's just come out and said, I did it. <clears throat> I figured out Clara's whereabouts. I'm be on my way right away. Okay, okay. Yeah. Quickly to rush to it. I know he sort of wants to sort of, you know. But what if it is a trap? I'm willing to take that risk. Okay. You, for Clara and for you. Oh, bless him. Or oh, she. I don't know. She, he. I don't know. Bless this person. Anyway. I have to finally stop this bastard. Besides, we're running out of time. If Clara's battery dies, I won't have a chance to find her anymore. Yeah, it's true. But it's no good for Clara if you put yourself in danger too. I'll... Look after myself. Don't worry. <sighs> really. Wow. Anyway. Somehow. I think he's getting in course. Shadow is getting in contact with Clara, I think. Let's see what happens here. Shadow. I'm on my way, Clara. Please hurry. I'm scared to death. This freak could come back any second. Oh dear, I just, uh, I'll take you out of there, whatever it takes. I've got a feeling it's going to be a trap, folks. I really think it's a trap. Thank you. Thank you for always being there for me. Oh no, I think my battery is about to die. Oh shit. Turn off your phone to be on the safe side. According to the GPS, I'll be there in 14 minutes. Woo. Is this a trap? Okay. Talk to you later. Hurry. Martin was stopped. And there we go. So Shadow's now on their way to try and rescue Clara. But like I say, it's getting more and more insane. This is... I'm hoping it's not a trap. Could Shadow be the next victim? Anyway, Tim's decided... Oh, hello, Tim. It's getting more and more insane. You can say that again. <laughs> Let you being accused from being Dr. Crow's associate too. Oh, dear. Let's do a quick recap. First, Dr. Crow invites us all to the healing group chat. Then he removed one after the other from it. Shortly after, we receive mysterious clues and his sick games begin. Lucy almost lost her life. And now we find out that one of us is cooperating with this lunatic. Hmm. 
Yeah, what's your, what's your point? Just spit it out, Tim. We've been assuming all along that there must be some kind of connection between us. It's even possible that we've run into each other before. After all, except for you, we all live not too far from each other. What if the healing group chat was created just to find out if one of us would figure out the connection? Or possibly even identify the traitor, Crow's helper? Don't explain everything. Yeah, it's true. We've got to find out who it, the mysterious stranger is. If we don't, we have a real problem. I will continue the others. Con I will content. <laughs> God, get it out of my mouth. Get it out of my mouth in a minute. So I even said mouth wrong. I will continue the others. I will contact the others. Why do I keep saying continue? I will contact the others one by one in a minute. Maybe one of them will give themselves away. Yeah, great. Let me know how it's going. Right, so Tim's going to be Detective Tim, I think. I will. But first, I'll have to take care of Lucy anyway. And I just went back to her place. Mmm, not safe. I did say Tim's potentially one of the... Oh. Oh, okay, comments galore. Anyway. Yeah, how is Lucy doing? Things are looking up, but she still needs to take it easy. Yeah. That's why I'd rather have Anna still here to support us. I thought you just said Anna's gone to... It's kind of funny that Anna wanted to be alone so badly. She wanted some time to herself. <clears throat> yeah, you shouldn't have let her go, Tim. Mm, probably the wrong thing to say. I would plead to ask her to stay, but couldn't convince her. Damn it. And that lunatic is chasing all of us. Hmm. I'll give her a call and make sure she got home okay. I'll get back to you later. Radio Tim, so... Wow. Why does Hannah want to get away so badly? Hmm, very curious. Anyway, Lucy's in contact with us, so she's good. Hey, fat boy, saw with a cry face. So nice to hear from you. I feel a little better now, you know. Hmm, bless. I owe a lot of that to you. Tim told me that you gave them the advice about the vial. I don't know if I would have made it without the adrenaline. By the way, I'm now at Tim's place. I could not be alone in the current situation. Tim takes very good care of me. Yeah, just please be careful anyway. So my mind's starting to change a little bit now with the suspects of the associate of Dr. Crow. I think, could it, oh, Tim, Hannah, could it? Could it really be them two? He is beside you, one of the few I still trust. My parents just called me from the uh, vacation, asked me if everything was okay. I almost burst into tears. Oh God. They knew I almost died today. All these wasps. Oh, Lucy, stop reminiscing. Just get on with it, love. Awkward and stuff. Anyway, I've been st uh, stung before as a child. 
The pain, every breath is like a fire that burns in your lungs. I was scared to death. I was seriously expecting to die in that coffin. And someone from our group is actually responsible for this in some way. Hmm. Shall we ask her? So is any is there anyone you suspect? What if Julius is right? Maybe Zoe is really behind it. She left the chat pretty quickly after she was confronted with it. That's very true, she's right. Yeah, I'm just going to put that, I can't exclude anyone at the moment. It's just, you know, after being sort of accused of it, do you know what I mean? There's too many suspects. I don't. I don't know. I mean, think back, Fat Boy Sai. Somehow he always makes an angry and aggressive impression, don't you think? Hmm. True. He's not the friendliest, but a traitor. Hmm. It's very, very true. I'm sorry, I'm just really scared. To be fair, Lucy, so would I. Anyway, fat boy, sorry, I'm going to rest a little bit more now. The whole thing really got to me. Oh, bless her. Well, it's nice to know she's sort of getting better. Anyway, it's all going crazy. But anyway, I think it's... Uh, well, I don't know. I, I don't know what to say. I'm just lost for words, folks. Who's who's who is this person? Is it Tim? Is it Julius? Is it Hannah? Is it Zoe? It's to me. It's too obvious to be Julius. I, I, why would they put the 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 sort of thing on Julius? It's just too obvious, isn't it? But oh, I don't know. Anyway, back to the stranger chat, Roxy. Um, is wanting to talk to everyone. Guys, we need to talk. Dun, dun, dun. Tim and Bernard are online. Anna is online. Anna's back on. Hmm. Sweetie, what's up? Anna says, Roxy, has something happened? Roxy says, I can't get it out of my head. One of us is a traitor. Everything we write here Anything we want to do with to fight Dr. Crow, the rat will give it away to Dr. Crow. I know we're a team and we wanted to stop him together, but I will do the same as Julius and leave the group now. Why? Yes, Roxy, we need to stick together. Fat boy Sai is right, Roxy. We'll get we'll only get through this as a group. That's very true. We have no choice. Right, she's left the group. So that's two from the group now gone. Now I forgot to mention did Julius did leave the group, so apologies for that. And now that Zoe is well Zoe is well left. Oh dear. What's going on? Oh my god, Lucy, sweetie, there's at least some good news. How are you? Are you feeling any better? Oh, Lucy. I'm not going to say anything. Just keep quiet. It's all good. Fat boy sigh. I still feel very weak, but what doesn't kill you? Yeah, makes you stronger and all that stuff. Uh, something's just come up on my Twitter about the bus service, which is weird. Anyway, I'm reading the chat history right now. Roxy now left the group too. Guys, we don't stand a chance alone. This monster will hunt us one by one. You shouldn't get so worked up in your condition, honey. 
I shouldn't get so worked up. Valentin, this monster almost killed me. That he did. Please excuse my lack of words. Hmm, yeah, as I say, you've been very quiet, Bernard. But participating in this conversation requires a careful analysis of the situation. Valentin, I have unfortunately also come to the conclusion that we should close the group. As long as we don't know who the traitor is among us, we can't carry on like this. Sorry guys, I started this group to stop Dr. Grow. Not to give his accomplice the opportunity to spy on us. I think we will close the group now. Now, I'm going to throw it out there. And let me just sort of reply quickly. But then we're all on our own. So what I'm going to say is very, very quickly. Now, if this group closes, I'm going to make a prediction. The very, very first person that's going to get in contact with me, I'm going to say right now that that person is, is, the, is the associate of Dr. Crow, is Dr. Crow's partner. I'm going to say it. I'm going to be bold and say it. Anyway. That's also the case with the traitor in our circle. So that's it. I'm sorry. Take care, guys. All right, so Ryan has now closed the group, so it looks like there is no more strangers chats. So let's get in contact. Zoe has uh, spoke to us. Anyway, maybe I overreacted. Sorry for leaving the group, but when Julius put me down like that, I lost it. Can you please add me back to the group? The group is no more. We've put the group on hold for now. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm afraid so. I mean, we should have probably put the first answer, to be fair. But anyway, oh, sh Come on then, Zoe. You're going to have a chat. On the one hand, that was probably the right thing to do. Because the traitor would find out all about... Sorry, find out about all our plans and next steps. But if we're still going to text around each other, and it's still going to be... I don't know, sort of Lucy and uh, Tim's going to be sort of Detective Tim and find out what's going on. But anyway, and therefore also Dr. Crow himself. On the other hand, this leaves everyone on their own and at Dr. Crow's mercy. On top of that, we have no way to expose the traitor. And what, it sh what do you suggest now? Candlelight dinner, Zoe? Glass of wine? Nice big fat juicy steak and all that. Damn. Anyway. Even if it means I'm putting myself in danger. We need to find our way to bring the group back together. How is that supposed to happen? Hmm. Good luck in trying it though. Because it ain't going to happen. I know I've had a little contact with most of the group so far. Correct. But I'll try anyway. Who knows? Maybe I can convince them to reactivate. Uh, yeah, reactivate the group. Keep your fingers crossed. So Zoe is now offline. So our last chat is going to be with the person himself or she self. I don't know. And that is Dr. Crow. Your eyes remain closed. Open them. And you realise I will lead you into paradise. Oh, really? I will choose the path of the blind and perish from the pestilence. Wow, what do we say here? Yeah. Stand up to him. Stand up to him, Simon. Damn straight. 
I'm going my own path. A path of shame. Lucy took the first steps. Her way is long, but she will keep going. The pestilence. The scourge. The great dying. She will soon be completely healed. Wow. What? What? Why are you on about that to crawl song, bitch? Stay alert and you will soon know the truth. Wow, if that's not if that's not a way to end an episode, I don't know what is. Anyway, Valentin's got in contact with us, but we're gonna save that for another part another time, folks. So like I say, thanks for watching as always, and like I say, I hope you subscribe to my channel and like this video as always. And uh, greatly appreciate it. And obviously give me your thoughts and comments on who you think the person is. Who is Dr. Crow? Who is Dr. Crow's associate? Who is behind this all? Who knows? No idea. The group has ended for now. What will happen next? There will be plenty more coming up soon, folks. So take care and stay safe. And I shall see you soon for more of The Healing. Bye.